ring. A marriage will take place either romantic or business. Okay. So this could be happiness. Yeah, this could be love, bliss. Older woman. This could be somebody getting a second chance. This older woman could be giving somebody a second chance in love. But it's like this older woman had to drop a burden first. Yeah. Because I asked for more information about the older woman. Yeah, I think this older woman could be possibly getting married, but she had to drop a burden first. Something was a burden to her, and it could possibly be her child. Possibly. A marriage will take place either romantic or business. Or this older woman, cancer, whoever this is, whether you this older woman or somebody else. <clears throat> you, this could be telling me you got married in the past to this man, this lover. And he became a burden or vice versa. Because it could be saying if, if you a cancer and you a man. Watching this, it could be saying you're dealing with the older woman, but she's a burden. Because it's like she expect your paycheck or something like that. She just expect things to go her way or some type of child support or something. Either one of them situations. But it's saying more information about this older woman judgment. This Ace of Cups is here. So this is love. This is happiness. And somebody is getting married, either in business or love. I think it's love because love is out here. Somebody getting married. Oh, I'm confused right there. Clarify judgment. Judgment. Two cards came out. Uh-oh. Peacock and spare. Peacock, beware of great pride. Spare. Heartache over what you no longer have. Judgment. Oh. Uh-oh. So. Somebody could be getting a second chance. They could have got a divorce, broke up, and they're getting a second chance. Or, or cancer, you could be giving somebody else a second chance. Or somebody is emotional. This could be somebody crying because a marriage will take place and they don't want it to. And because of this judgment, this could be somebody crying because they didn't get some type of marriage proposal or somebody not don't want to take their proposal because it's a heartache over what you no longer have. Beware of great pride. So this older woman could be calling judgment on possibly a man, her ex. Because it say beware of great pride. That's what I'm saying. Somebody in, in this energy cancel you about somebody else was entitled. They felt as though when I call you, if I'm in trouble, you, you will be taken care of in difficult times. This person wanted somebody to take care of them. And it say beware of great pride. Somebody is calling judgment on somebody with great pride. 
And this person going to be in heartache, oh, heartache over what they no longer have. And what they no longer have is this marriage. A marriage will take place. No, it ain't. Judgment is here. Ace of Cups. I thought this was happiness at first. But that no, that's somebody crying. Somebody is crying. Tears. Mm. What? Older woman. Dealings or relationship with their older woman. It makes sense though. Because somebody burdened. This ten of wands is right here. Somebody is tired of somebody. They tired of them. And Ace of Cups and Judgment. The marriage, Cancer, you could be somebody's fiance or if you're a male watching, you proposed to somebody. And it became a burden. And I think somebody, this older woman, somebody calling judgment. Because somebody felt entitled. Beware of great pride. Heartache over what you no longer have. Yeah, somebody felt entitled probably to somebody. Um, money and they probably wasn't even married yet they probably wasn't even married yet i don't know but that's what i got and i'm gonna end it right now because cancer you or somebody else dealing dealings dealing dealings or relationship with an older woman mm. Or cancer, if you're a female, this could be you burdened because your person was given to two. And the other woman was this older woman. The older woman could have been that other woman. And cancer, if you're a female, he, he had the nerve to be given to two. And wanted some type of recognition and reward from you. But he out there giving to two. And wanted some type of recognition and reward from you. And it became a burden to you. It became a burden. So you, you let it all go. You let it go. Yeah, because for a man to be giving to two women. And then expect recognition and reward from the women he hurting. That's pride. That's prideful. That's crazy. Yeah, beware of great pride. Heartache over what you no longer have. Yep. Something like that going on. Clarify this older woman. Fifteen, the letter is a sign of good tidings when near. Number 47, the bride ensures for a single person the fulfillment of their highest aims. So this older woman got some good news. Somebody got their way and somebody didn't. That's what I'm getting from this. Somebody got their way in the situation and somebody didn't. The letter is a sign of good tidings. Maybe this older woman got some good news. I don't know. I don't know. But that's it. That's what cancer. This is Blood Queen Tarot. And this was your reading for the month of January 2021. And um, you can visit my channel. Like, subscribe, share, comment. comment. Again, Blood Queen Tarot. Also, please keep in mind that this video or any video may or may not resonate with you. And even if it does resonate with you, it still may not be for you. So you just got to remember that. Keep that in the back of your mind when you reading or listening to Tarot. Thank you.